I'm Wendy the Candle Lady. Welcome to the lifestyle section of the How To DIY TV series. Today I'd like to tell you a little bit about how to burn pillar candles. The first step is for you to always make sure that when you're placing your pillar candles out, if you're using more than one, space them evenly and separate them by about five centimeters. That way the heat from the smaller candles doesn't affect the size of the taller ones. They burn properly. Secondly, if you need to dust off a candle or polish it up because it's got fingerprints on it, you might use an old nylon stocking. It clears it up and doesn't stick to the wax. Third, you want to always keep your wicks trimmed to about a half a centimeter. Half a centimeter would be the perfect size so that the candle burns properly. Don't just trim the wick the first time, trim it all the way down. Snuffing candles out in order to extinguish them is the proper way to put out a candle, keeping the wick straight and also making sure that you don't blow wax onto your thing. And last but not least, at the end of the burn time, after burning a pillar for about three hours, the edges of the candle will be soft. And what you need to do is hug the candle in and lightly press the edges down towards the wick. That way, you can start with a candle this tall and finish with a candle this tall every time. I'm Wendy the Candle Lady. Thanks for letting me light up your life.